Hi, I'm Priestess Sally Pullinger, trained with Cathy Jones, and I became a Priestess of Avalon in 2001. And I've been working with Cathy and all the Priestesses of Avalon here, and also Priestesses of Bridie, Priestesses of Rhiannon, Caridwen. Such a wealth of wonderful Priestess trainings that happen here in Glastonbury, Avalon, where I'm lucky enough to live and serve the Goddess. So I'm bringing forward to you a taster course. It's a taster course of my work as a priestess oracle, as a medium. I've been a trance medium all my life. And I say all my life since I was 25. Um, that's quite a long time. It's now 46 years. And I'm bringing you as priests and priestesses of goddess the culmination of that work in a training that is opening up the area of your mediumship and how to work with your mediumship to become an oracle, a priestess oracle, a priest oracle of goddess, somebody who um, knows how to open your, your light body, your whole being, to let the presence come forward from essentially within you. So in this course, I really am um, bringing forward a, a lifetime of knowledge, of experience with spirit beings, divine beings who come through and talk to people and what that feels like on the inside and how I have worked to become a clearer and clearer um, a vessel, channel, medium, oracle for goddess and for spirit beings. In this course, I'm going to be talking a lot about the way of it, the how of it, because we're all mediumistic, but it's how, how what steps to take, what practices to do, how to focus your mind, your heart, your body, so that you are aligned to the most natural part of you, really, which, as a priest, priestess of goddess, you have been working on yourself, of course, maybe for a long time, maybe your whole life, or maybe you've just come upon that, that truth for yourself. But either way, the message or the calling, you know, it came from within you. And so the goddess talks to us from the inside, but not necessarily in words. She's coming through all the time. She's out in all of nature. She's everywhere and in everything. But she's not necessarily in human words. And an oracle is bringing through that presence in words, in sound, sometimes in, in you know, the voices of light or the star voices. Sometimes that's how it begins. But ultimately, what you want to be able to do is bring through a message for a beloved or for for someone who comes forward to you and needs something to be comprehensible to their mind. They need it spoken in a word. So how do you translate this presence, this energy of goddess in everything, the, the cosmic presence of goddess at every level of her manifestations into words or into a comprehensible presence in a human being. That's what's happening. You are really translating or um, transmitting the presence, bringing it in and delivering it, um, making it into a nourishing food, an offering from your soul to the soul of someone else. And I'm sure that if you are priestess, priest of goddess, you're already doing this in many, many ways. Some of you may already be experiencing this and perhaps this course will just help you clarify a little more kind of scientifically what it is to work with your energy body, to become aware of the beings that are around you, how goddess is also manifesting. You could say through many levels of manifestation, she's coming through spirit beings in her world. She's bringing you help in all kinds of ways in nature. She's working through animals, birds, water beings. She's, she's working through the flowers and the earth, the crystals, the presences. 
she is everything. And so it, it's a type of shamanism, really, working with goddess and working with your body of light and working to realize how the great web of connection that you're never separate and once you understand your own body and your physical body your sensual body your sensations and impressions and how your intuitions are working and how that voice of goddess is expressing to you you begin to realize oh my goodness it's in everything it's it's i've always got her with me and you you experience more and more cohesion and alignment and life makes more and more sense because you're never separate and you understand that really from morning to night and night to morning you are priestess priest there's never a switching off button you're always in service. Sometimes you need to be in service to yourself, and this is self-development work. You know, it's always important to work on yourself. So this is an offering to you to help you go deeper into your own being, into your essence, into your soul's truth. And as you are called onto the path of goddess, of course, she is already in you, speaking to you. But what what is that? How do you recognize it? How do you interpret it? And getting brave around that, getting confident around your ability to bring forward the voice of goddess, the voice that originally might sound like the cry of a bird or the howling of a wolf or the, the whit-to-woo of an owl or a whale or a dolphin. And, and why is she bringing those voices to you when you hear them? What does it mean? How is she speaking to you? And above all, how is she speaking through you? And how do you let her speak through you more to all your beloved, either students, clients, friends, family, all the beings that you want to help meet goddess in their lives? Because that is the work that we're all involved with. That's what really matters is to switch on the consciousness on this earth to the presence of goddess in every moment, in every, in everything, in every being all around and bring it to the hearts of people for healing, to bring wholeness, to bring enlightenment, to bring love, to bring connection, communion, to bring peace, to bring harmony, and ultimately to create a new earth together. So I really look forward to talking to you, meeting you, and uh, this is a taster course because I'm going to bring a whole year's deep dive training um, once the temple opens again because I would, I would rather do it in person. I'm happy to do this online if really uh, you know, it takes longer than we think, then I will bring a course out, also a longer course for you online for those who want to go deeper. But I do project that it will be a physical course. Um, I know we're all longing to work together physically again. So I bless you this day. Thank you for listening. And I look forward to meeting you. Goddess, blessings, peace and love.